Mental well-being, mental health, what that means to me is that we are all individuals, that sometimes external pressures get on top of us. There's different kind of stresses and strains in, in everyone's life. Um, how we deal with that is, is going to have an effect on your mental health. While at work when chatting to people, a lot of them don't like to open up about mental health because it's a big stigma around talking about it. You ask people and everybody just says they're okay, everything's okay, when you know and you can spot the changes in people. At Scotrail we've got a range of support available um, to support our physical well-being, mental well-being, emotional well-being. We've also got a vast network of mental health first aiders. Uh, we've got approximately 75 across the network in all different locations um, and roles as well. As a mental health first aider, it's quite important that the organisation has, uh, not just myself but several bank of, uh, of colleagues throughout the organisation nationwide. It might not always be work related, it can be family life as well, it can be problems outside of work which have a knock on effect to your actual job. In my experience, I think have, things have improved dramatically. It's good to see that there's such a, a good network of support there and if they do need a chat or a coffee, you know, we're always there to help. It's time to talk. It's time to talk. It's time to talk. It's time to talk. It's time to talk today. It's time to talk every day.